Welcome to Mediogre Gaming, and today we're playing Tom Clancy's The Division. Now entering a safe area. Well, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and salutations. Today, it's the Life Exotic. Let's get to it. The Marshall Shield is now available to be earned, and in order to get it, you need to have every single exotic that is available, both weapons and armor. So that means the Golden Rhino, the Damascus, the Centurion, Showstopper, Medved, Cassidy, Devil, Heal, Tenebrae, Historian, Big Alejandro, Hungry Hog, Pecan, Hilder, Iyer, Tommy Gun, Thompson, Midas, House, Urban MDR, Warlord, Liberator, Caduceus, Bullfrog, plus the armor, Larray's Bulletproof Vest, Pharaoh's Oxygen Mask, Short Bow, Championship Pads, Ninja Bike Messenger Bag, Skull M, Sea Gloves, and Colonel Bliss Holster. And that is a lot. So in order to get all those items, if you're just starting, some of the items you can get from the special equipment vendor and only from the special equipment vendor in the base, in the basement. Other than that, you're going to want to go to the Dark Zone or other areas that have name bosses and take them out. Go to the legendary missions there are seven legendary missions and the first clear of each new week has a guaranteed exotic cash drop which will give you an exotic uh, now they may, may all be the same exotic or they may be some duplicates or may all be different we don't know it is all from the same loot pool so you have equal chance of getting every exotic except for the ones from the special equipment vendor additionally the global event Superior Cash has a chance to give you an exotic, a small chance, maybe 3%. And the weekly assignment caches can give you an exotic. So the best way, of course, is doing the legendary missions. Seven legendary missions within the week. Do it once. You're guaranteed one exotic for the first clear. Once you're done with that and you're still missing exotics, go into the dark zone and while you're in the dark zone, make sure to do any supply drops or contamination events because they have a good chance of dropping an exotic, as well as classified gear if you're still looking for classified gear set pieces. Take out name bosses. They have a chance of dropping exotics. They have a guaranteed two item drop. The third item drop, if there is a third item, it will either be a classified piece or an exotic. And, of course, the Dark Zone caches, which you will need a key to open. And, of course, a lot of the loot that you get in the Dark Zone does need to be extracted. So you will want to be careful and get that out safely. If you do have a group of people that you run with, do make sure that you run with them in the Dark Zone. Safety and numbers and all of that. And that's it. If you're only missing a couple, good luck getting those couple. If you don't have the majority of them, good luck on your journey to get them. It will take you some time. Even if you're only missing one, it may take a little bit to get it. I know there's a lot of people that were trying to get the house for a long time before it actually dropped for them. Well, make sure you ring the bell before you leave to be notified of all future episodes as soon as they go live. And thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing. And we'll see you next time. Area secure. Seconds 
Successful extraction complete. Supply drops incoming. Uploading coordinates.